Welcome to the Valley General Hospital. This virtual training is intended for use by clinicians and respiratory technicians trained in the management of respiratory failure, secondary to moderate to severe exacerbation of chronic obstructive airway disease, COAD, and acute cardiogenic pulmonary edema, APO. It is designed to complement the actual direct equipment in-service training and maintenance of skill and knowledge of the NIV machine patient interface. This is an emergency resuscitation room. You are alone with a first year nursing graduate who is in the medication room to your far right. Your patient has IV access. He is already attached to a heart rate, oxygen and blood pressure monitor. His vitals are on the monitor. Can you identify them? Have a look above you. Good work. His medical records are at the foot of the bed. Can you locate them? Good. On top of the red trolley is the non-invasive ventilator machine. Look behind the machine and ensure it is connected to the oxygen supply from the wall. Excellent. An arterial blood gas report has been collected. Can you take a look? Good. Now that you are familiar with your patient and surroundings, it's time to complete your task. Your patient is distressed, but alert and comfortable with NIV. He has no contraindications to NIV. The single lumen tubing is already attached to the ventilator. Pick up the plastic template which has three holes labelled small, medium and large. Good. And place it over the patient's face. Good. Pick up the mask which best covers the patient's nasal bridge and chin. Good. And place it on his lap. Excellent. Now turn on the ventilator. The power button is located on the bottom left of the panel. Good. Select IPAP. Change the setting to 10. Select EPAP. Change the setting to 5. Select FIO2. Change the setting to 50%. Select Rate. Good. Set the rate to 14. Great work. Now pick up the mask and apply it over the patient's face, covering the bridge of his nose and chin. Secure the Velcro straps to his head. Excellent. Now monitor the patient's vitals. Observe the patient. He is comfortable and happy. Remember to repeat the blood gas and iStat in 30 minutes. Also, obtain a chest x-ray. Congratulations! You have set the non-invasive ventilator in a typical setting for bi-level positive pressure ventilation. Thanks for visiting the Valley General Hospital.